like to brag on these girls for just a minute and brag on Miss Barth as well. You may not realize, but it has been 12 years since our Girls Chorale has received a Superior State Contest, and this year under Miss Barth's direction, our ladies received a Superior. So this year we actually had two groups that received, that advanced to the state level. We had the Women's Chorale and Varsity Ensemble. Both of them received straight ones on stage. So congratulations to all our students.
Just a side note about that song. It, hopefully there are some of you or many of you that realize that that's a song that is traditionally sung in Fenway Park in Boston. And so the fact that the guys picked that as one of the songs they wanted to sing this spring, I think was pretty timely in terms of the, the tragedy in Boston and the events in Boston and a, and a show of solidarity for the people of Boston. So um, I'm kind of proud of the fact that they did that. Thanks to Mrs. Barth for her leadership in making that happen. The first song that concert choir is going to sing is from one of my all-time favorite musicals called Ragtime. And um, without going into too much detail, it's a very involved plot, um, but it basically focuses on um, three different groups of people and how they struggle for equality amongst each other. And the song is called Make Them Hear You, and it's sung at the very end of the show when um, the characters are telling the future generations go out and tell our story, tell what happened to us, tell how we had to fight for equality and make them hear you, make sure they hear about our story and further that um, quest for equality. So.
First of all, I'd like to thank you for coming this evening. There's lots of thanks to go out this evening, and, and the first people that I'd like to publicly thank are all those who helped out and worked in concessions this year. So if you helped out in music concessions, would you please stand so we can say thank you. If you helped out in concessions, please stand.
if you help to chaperone any of the concerts or the OMEA contest, would you please stand so we can thank you? And finally, I'd like to, to thank the ladies who helped to, to make this all possible, who helped to do the organizing of this this year. It wasn't easy. Both of them had, had lots of challenges in, in lives and jobs this year, but they, they found a way to make it happen, which just kind of proves the adage that, that not everybody can do everything, but everybody can do something. So I would like to thank publicly Mrs. Connie Irby, Thank you, Connie. Thank you, Connie, so much. Love you, dear. And Mrs. Chris Simon. Now the next piece that we're going to sing is a piece that we learned for state contest with Varsity Ensemble, and admittedly I kind of missed the boat on this one, because it's a, it is a piece that was written um, essentially within the Catholic liturgy for the Christmas time, but it's on, on the um, OMEA contest list, and one of the things we had to do this year was to replace one of our pieces for state contest. When you make state contest, you have to replace one of your numbers. And we replaced Shenandoah, which is the piece that we sang with the Hamilton Fairfield Symphony, with this piece, O Monum Mysterium. It's a piece that I don't do every year. It takes a special choir to do this because it takes a heck of a lot of control and lots of careful uh, attention to tuning and intonation. O Monum Mysterium.
Is there any question that we have a wealth of riches here at Wooden Woods High School? And now we get to hear all these incredible voices together for a tradition that's lasted over 50 years in the Battle Hymn of the Republic. So please join us.
this is the section of the concert which to me sort of symbolizes the, the beginning of the end with, with this group of seniors, uh, certainly for us. This, this group, I have to tell you, not only do they sound, sound incredibly good when they sing, but they also are amazingly bright, incredibly articulate, and just superb leaders as well. Uh, when when Miss Barth and I sat down to talk about the awards for the year, it was like, oh, that student really deserves it, and that student really deserves it, and that student really deserves it, and it just the list kind of goes on and on with this group. They are, they have so much depth, and truly have been. Um, I, d I have to say they've been one of the most pleasant group of seniors that I've had to work with in, in my entire teaching career, and I guess that kind of says a lot in 34 years. So I'm, I'm very proud of these guys, love them a lot. They, they've, we've been through tremendous amount in, in the past four years together and have always managed to come out on top. So these are my babies. and. I give them back to you tonight, so thank you all so much. <laughs> Taylor Baird is a member of Varsity Ensemble. <laughs> Taylor plans to attend Ohio University for Music Education and Psychology. She received both academic and music scholarship. <laughs> Brianna Chenault is a member of Concert Choir. <laughs> Brianna plans to, plans to attend Xavier University and major in pre-med and pediatrics. She received the Dean's Award Scholarship. Karan Connors is a member of Men's Chorus. <laughs> Karan plans to attend Cincinnati State for general coursework and then transfer to the University of Cincinnati. He would like to study vocal performance. <laughs> Tahaya Cooper is a member of Women's Chorus. Tahaya plans to attend Central State to major in social work. <laughs> Terrell Cooper is a member of Varsity Ensemble. <laughs> Terrell plans to attend the University of Cincinnati College of Business to major in finance. Luis de Jesus is a member of Varsity Ensemble. <laughs> Luis plans to attend Cincinnati State University to study audio production, music production, sound engineering, and entrepreneurship, as well as business management. Darnell Dees is a member of Varsity Ensemble. <laughs> Darnell plans to attend the Ohio State University and major in business. I, th I think you're what, the fourth Dees in a row that's had a full scholarship to college? Darnell received the Morrell Scholarship, Federal Pell Grant, and an OSU grant, so we're proud of that. Sarah Dries is a member of Varsity Ensemble. Sarah also plans to attend The Ohio State University and major in Arts Management.
Stacia Hackman is a member of Varsity Ensemble. <laughs> Stacia plans to attend Valparaiso University, that's up by Chicago, to major in social work. She's received the Valparaiso Honors Award, Valpo Fund Alumni Scholarship, the Lutheran Gift Award, and Friends of the Theater Scholarship. Blake Howard is a member of Varsity Ensemble. Blake plans to attend The Ohio State University to major in computer engineering and minor in Spanish. Madeline Johnson is a member of Varsity Ensemble. Don't go away, don't go away. Stay here, stay here. <laughs> Madeline plans to attend Wittenberg University to major in communications and music, received a music scholarship. Now I should say, Madeline went to school with these guys when she was in middle school, right? Elementary school then went to the School for Creative and Performing Arts, and then came back to where the grass is greener. So. <laughs> Jasmine Jones is a member of Varsity Ensemble. Jasmine plans to attend the Ohio State University to study materials engineering. She received a partial scholarship. <laughs> Anna Lale is a member of Concert Choir. <laughs> Hang on. Anna plans to work for a year, then attend a performing arts school in California to study acting. <laughs> Patricia Lane is a member of Varsity Ensemble. <laughs> Patricia plans to work for a year and then attend college. Shannon Lynch is a member of Varsity Ensemble. <laughs> Shannon plans to attend Tiffin University where she received a music scholarship. Dorian Marshall is a member of Varsity Ensemble. <laughs> Dorian plans to attend Miami University Hamilton Branch, study cello performance, and then wants to go to Miami University Oxford. <laughs> Sabrina Mercer is a member of Varsity Ensemble. Sab Sabrina plans to attend DePaul University to major in international studies on a partial scholarship. <laughs> Elise Mills is a member of Varsity Ensemble. <laughs> Elise plans to attend Ohio University to major in public relations. Ryan Murray is a member of Concert Choir. <laughs> Ryan plans to attend Diamond Oaks and participate in Career X, which is a career exploration program. <laughs> P. 
Keisha Noble is a member of Women's Chorale. Keisha plans to attend Northern Kentucky University to major in nursing. Jacoy Owens is a member of Varsity Ensemble. Jacoy plans to attend Wright State University to major in civil and mechanical engineering. Alona Pasichnik is a member of Women's Chorale. Alona plans to major in business at Cincinnati State. Maurice Pope is a member of Pontifical. Maurice, there he went, plans to work for a year and then attend college the following year. Donnie Sharamsey is a member of Varsity Ensemble. Donisha plans to attend the University of Cincinnati to study fashion design. Lejean Scott is a member of Pasico. Lejean plans to attend Akron University to study musical arts and sciences with musical productions pre-major. Nathan Semsbrot is a member of Varsity Ensemble. Nathan plans to attend Cincinnati State to major in computer sciences. <laughs> Alethea Sims is a member of Varsity Ensemble. Alethea plans to attend Hampton University to major in nursing. She received several scholarships. Shikendra Smiley is a member of Concert Club. Shikendra plans to attend Miami University Middletown to major in nursing. Alex Stroop is a member of Varsity Ensemble. <laughs> Alex plans to attend the University of Cincinnati to major in communications. Rashad Sylvester is a member of Varsity Ensemble. Rashad plans to attend Tiffin University to major in music production and minor in business management. He received both academic and music scholarships. Adam Toll is a member of Varsity Ensemble. Adam's college plans are yet undecided. <laughs> Jalen Walker is a member of Varsity Ensemble. <laughs> J 
Jalen plans to attend Miami University Oxford to major in graphic design or design engineering. Shanice Weichman is a member of Varsity Ensemble. Shanice plans to attend Miami University Oxford to major in experimental psychology. She received a Red Hawk scholarship. Eric Wiles Jr. is a member of men's class. <laughs> Eric plans to attend Kent State University and join the National Guard. His tuition will be paid by the National Guard due to his ASVAB scores. Okay, so we have a little something for our directors. Um, hopefully I don't cry. <laughs> First, I just want to say something about how much these two have done for us. Um, I mean, you guys, you guys know Mr. Bell. He's, <laughs> he is more than just a teacher to us, to all of us, no matter what choir we're in. He is like, <laughs> he is Papa Bell and Mama Barth. And they mean the world to all of us, all of us seniors up here. I can I speak for all of them. So we have flowers from Ms. Barth, and we have cards wrote to them. And um, uh, what? <laughs> oh. <laughs> um, we have a card for Mr. Angle as well, our piano teacher this year. So if he could come out here. Mr. Angle, come out here. Thank you so much. Um, it looks like we don't have a lot for our directors, but that's because we have something bigger in mind for the two of them that hopefully will mean more than any trivial thing that we can give them. So our plan is to redo the makeup room for them. So... We will be repainting it and mirrors and the whole shebang. So that is our gift to you. And uh, I love you. So thank you again for everything you've done for us. And I'm going to miss you guys.
Copies of this program are available for $20 each. Send program title along with your address and check or money order to Waycross Community Media. Attention Dub Coordinator, 2086 Waycross Road, Forest Park, Ohio 45240 or buy securely on the web at www.waycross.tv.